What sources of energy will the world run on in 2035? The world is growing more and more hungry for energy. By 2035, global demand for energy may shoot up by more than one third. So where is this extra energy going to come from? And what sources are going to be used? The International Energy Agency has projected a scenario which takes account of the policy commitments that have already been announced by governments around the world. If this scenario comes true, then by 2035, oil production hits 96 million barrels per day on the back of rising output of natural gas liquids and unconventional oil, while crude oil production plateaus. Coal demand increases by 20% with the biggest increase coming from China, where new coal-fired generation exceeds the current capacity of the US, the European Union, and Japan. Demand for gas rises by 44% in the next 25 years, led by China and the Middle East. Renewable energy sources and nuclear power account for 45% of total global generation of energy. Commitments that countries have made to reduce their greenhouse gas emissions collectively fall short of what's required to limit the global temperature increase to 2 degrees Celsius, as rising demand for fossil fuels will continue to drive up energy-related CO2 emissions. When we look at the global energy markets today, there are two major challenges. One is the oil security, the other one is the climate change. Almost all the countries in the world are putting policies in place to address these challenges. However, when we look in our flagship publication, World Energy Outlook, the implications of these policies that the countries are putting in place, they are far from being enough to put us on a sustainable pattern. So as IEA, International Energy Agency, we are doing our best to help our member countries, but as well as all the others, in order to give them guidance, give them suggestions to make best policies to address these two strategic challenges.